Hello, everybody. Welcome to D-Pad. I'm Rick. Excuse me. I'm Bubbly. And this is Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Uh, there's a couple things we're going to be doing today. Uh, first of all, I'm going to head to the clothing trunk for a second and Tonka. see if uh, see if there's some fun stuff for us to do with Miles. Nope. That's creepy. That looks like a fucking Diglett Cordyceps. I do it. Nope. Do it. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of on the fence with the glasses. What do you think? Tonka's being a butt. What do you think uh, of the, I think those are kind of cute. Yeah. Yeah? All right. It's making Eevee look like an old lady. <laughs> it kind of does, which is sort of a sweet <laughs> a sweet thing there. Uh, I really wish you could rotate, because you can't see what the fuck is going on with these. Uh, an accessories, sapphire bandana. Oh, it's, oh like it's like that? Oh, that's... Oh, it's probably wrapped around, like... I guess... I'll put it on for... Oh, okay, you can do different places. I forgot about this. You can't... I can't tell... Do tail. Yeah. But it is fucking dumb that you can't. Like, <sighs> alright, if I do... If I go to this... I can sort of see it. <laughs> like... Actually, you know what? Ironically, the best place to look at is gonna be like this. Oh, it just oh, kind of looks like a little bow. On the tail, okay. It's not as much it's as I was hoping for, but it's... Yeah, that's more of a ribbon than anything. It's kind of cute, though. I'll keep it there. Uh, also, let's do some TM finagling. Mm -hmm. uh, so headbutt. Oh, I actually have that as a TM, too. It's hilarious. Everybody can learn it. I don't know that I really want to give it to anybody right now. Payday, Seismic Toss, Scald. Uh, all right, Dragon Tail. Ah, Vulpix can't learn it. Damn. Yeah. I was like, if Vulpix can learn it, I mean, the odds of it getting one level before we're done with the gym is pretty decent, so I'm not too concerned there. Uh, U-turn. Nobody can learn that. Ah, oh. That's a bummer. I thought Pikachu would be able Nobody to Nobody can learn Play Rough either. What? All right, so Play Rough is a fairy move. So Alolan Ninetales might be able to do this. That but, would make sense. But it also is only incrementally better than Dazzling Gleam, and it's also less accurate, so I don't know if I really would care to do Play Rough. Facade. Yeah, doubles if the, if the user's poison burned or paralyzed. Everybody can learn it. I don't know if I want to no, uh, apply mm. that to anybody, though, you know? Because I have to willingly let them have a status condition to be able to do anything with that. Yeah, or set up something funky with, like, Poison Ball and Toxic right. Heal or whatever. Thunderbolt. Latif can learn Thunderbolt. That might not be a terrible mm. call. Especially, John's never going to get rid of that Gyarados, so having good electric availability might be nice. Toxic Headbutt, Bite, and Dig. Uh, dig is gonna be good once she evolves. Toxic is excellent right now because it will always land. Take uh, it over and bite. Why would you keep bite? Sixty plus flinch, seventy plus flinch. Then neither of them are stab. Yeah. Um, this would be good against a psychic Pokemon, but other than th and a ghost Pokemon, but other than that. There's not a major difference between these, so maybe maybe bite should I guess go. Bite is physical, whereas no, oh, but you still physical. have headbutt. So. Yeah, headbutt is ten stronger. The only difference is it's normal instead of dark, which just means that if John does ultimately bring you know Edgar the fourth onto his team, then I won't be able to use that. Which but, I mean, bite's whatever. not that great of a move anyway. Yeah. Thunderbolt is ninety, may paralyze. Yeah, I think we're gonna get rid of bite. Oh, chonka chonka, being a snuggle face. She's freaking out with the lightning and stuff. I and the, like I need to be around And the people. thunderbolt. Nobody learned waterfall either. I was act I felt pretty certain that somebody would be able to. Ooh, mind free can learn shadow ball. Oh, that's real good. That's a that's an interesting one. He's he's got to have something you can replace for shadow ball. Uh, probably yeah. Oh God, scary. Hypnosis and side beam aren't going anywhere. Headbutt I just put on, though I do have a TM for that, but it is a nice physical move. Uh, let's see. Shadow Ball is 80 and may lower special defense. Headbutt is 70 and may flinch. Sh Shadow Ball is really good. It is pretty good. It's it's the question of, do I, I want... I think Disable is that great on him. He's the only thing not that I, fast. Right? The only thing I was but. keeping Disable for was it'd be nice against John's team to be able to disable something if it's going to fuck me, but, like, but that's like one what? Pokemon, one move, and, like... Uh... Yeah, let's toss it. 
being able to have a decided advantage if it's like Hypno versus Kadabra or something would be would be useful. Yeah. Um, and just generally having more anti psychic moves before we deal with Sabrina would be nice. <laughs> Tongue's being <laughs> such a goof. Right, helping it, no. Light screen, no. Protect, reflect, no. All right. Who so I can, think learn can anyone learn protect? Everybody, Everybody can, can learn protect. protect. Which who's is nice, but all it does is stall stuff out. Yeah, who's got toxic? I mean, I guess. Uh, but I think, was it, uh, Latifah's got toxic and dig. So, the uh, like, it's equally as effective, plus I can do damage. So Yeah, I guess that's true. Um, all right. Thing three, time for the candy jar. Uh, we're not going to do rare candies yet. I'm going to wait till we actually fight Erica for that. Uh, but let's start with some Eevee candies. Yeah, because just before Erica, you want to see if you can evolve Vulpix. Yeah. If you can, you know, eke out any. So these aren't exactly Eevees. They are explicitly adding to stat like things. Yeah. Yeah, it's different. So it's a it's a bit more immediate of a of a of an effect, and it's like more permanent, I guess. All right. Well, so <laughs> I mean, EVs are pretty permanent. Well, I guess so. That's true. Yeah. Uh, so Bellsboro candy we can't use. Uh, the XL candies are for level thirty. Or sorry, XL we can't use because those are level sixty or higher. But the large ones are for thirty or higher. So everybody but Vulpix and Mindfree can use those. Uh, so let's see. We have attack. We have defense. We have speed. Uh, so speed, I want to use on... Uh, Can Pikachu use light screen? Uh, yeah. I feel like that's a good option to have on Pikachu. I'm going to use... Actually, let's do... Because it's so fast, you know? I mean, that's true. I'm going to put some speed on Courtney. Because the faster the faster Curtney can be, the better of a of a like utility tank uh, she will be. All right, let's do uh, let's do some on. I, I think I want to put some on Vulpix, just because if it's gonna be fragile, I may as well try to beef some stats up. Yeah, being fast and being able to confuse Ray is pretty good. Yeah. All right. Keep going. Uh, one more like this. And then I think I'm going to do some from Mind Freak and Latifa. Because uh, not particularly quick, so. Ooh, I saw some lightning on that yeah. one. Yeah. All right. Okay, uh, now for the L's. Oh, it's gotten really far away, huh? I guess so. It took a that. while for that thump. Ooh! That's a big one. What the fuck? Uh, let's see, so... One for Courtney here. What the f- It's, like, still going. Jesus Christ. Uh... Let's do some for Miles as well, why not? Okay. What is CP? Uh, combat power. It's like a rough approximation of overall strength. It's a thing from Pokemon Go. Yeah. Why is it in this game? I don't know. Uh, why is it ordered this way? By type. There we go. Do, 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 beep, oh, no. Beep, uh, man. Beep, 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 no, no, no. <sighs> By name. There we go. All right, so Courage Candy is Special Defense. Health is HP. Mighty Candy is Attack. Quick... Uh, I can't do that one. Smart Candy is Special Attack. Tough Candy is Defense. So, okay. Defense. Who needs Defense? Um, Anyone who uh, has a new yard. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm going to put a shitload of these on Vulpix. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Because having Vulpix not be so fragile would be really, really nice. Alright. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Okay. Uh, I guess let's put some on 
Mind Freak. And some on Latifa. Alright. Beep! Beep! Come on. Alright. This one over here. So yeah, it's interesting. The candy stuff definitely uh definitely uh unbalances a lot of this a lot of this game for sure. Um, it seems crazy that you can just keep jamming these candies yeah. into them. Like uh, I guess Miles and maybe Courtney are about to get a big infusion of uh, of the large ones too. So the benefit is the large and extra ones seem to be recorded separately in terms of like how many you need for the next unit, which is nice because it's back to one. Even though Miles would have needed five regular candies for it before. I see. I see. I'm gonna keep going until Miles needs two. God damn. Alright. Jesus Christ. How many how many are you gonna take here, Miles? Why is Mind Freaks needs one in red? Because oh, they're not level he's 30. Not available. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna give the last five to Courtney. <laughs> Miles is almost as defensive as Courtney. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually, yeah, stat wise, the, the starter Pokemon are just bonkers to begin with. Uh, all right. Um, courage candy is for special defense. Um, I guess Vulpix. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to get Vulpix to not be quite so fragile in general. Courage candy L. Uh, let's do one for Courtney, because actually I'm just gonna do both for Courtney because that's a big big weakness. Water would be a huge problem. Yeah. Uh, hit points. Who needs hit points? Um, yep. Yeah. I'm just going to try to make Vulpix as, you know, survivable as possible here. Health Candy L. Um, I got to the Miles. Why not? A little bit of a something there. Mighty Candy is for physical attack. Uh, needs eight. My God. Um, that was a... Probably Courtney or Latifa. Let's try Latifa first. Yes, Latifa. All right. I got one mighty Although, candy L. Latifa can learn a bunch of different special attacks too. So that's true. But I'll do one for Miles for that. It's fine if she's like a mixed attacker. Yeah. Smart candy special attack. Uh. Yeah. Mind Freak and Vulpix come to mind immediately for this. Yeah, Vulpix's stats are not great. Yep. I mean, it'll evolve. Yeah. So don't forget about that. Tough Candy is defense. But Everybody needs two more. Oh, I just did that one a minute ago. That's why. <laughs> I think that's all of them. I'm going to save the Rare Candies for the very end. Yeah. Because the effect is always larger if you wait out, wait it out a little longer. I'm going to go heal. So to anyone wondering... Uh, why I'm doing the the Celadon Gym without... So I'm going to do the Celadon Gym now. I'm not going to do the Pokemon... Uh, the Game Corner. Um, main reason is I am coming up on John's levels. Uh, and it'd be nice to have that as kind of an insurance package if I lose against John to be able to go and level up some more without sitting and grinding. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do it regardless, but it'll be, you know, if just it's necessary, that'll be, that'll be useful to have. Order a little bit, yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, okay, so I'm going up against pretty nearly, so I'm fighting a bunch of grass Pokemon, almost all of which are also going to be poison Pokemon. Yeah. Uh, so. Except for like Tangela. Yeah, I think Tangela is like one of the only ones. Um, there might be a Paris or something. Yeah. All right. Duh. Okay, yeah, she's super cute with the glasses. But, uh... Oh, bye! <laughs> <laughs> I see you! <laughs> you can't run! <laughs> uh, so Vulpix would be pretty good at uh, taking out a bunch of shit. Yeah, I think I might do that to, for the sake of giving it some extra level, uh, Like, to give it some levels, honestly. Yeah. Um, it's full of strong trainers. Look at all them babes! <laughs> Just str strong, strong babes. St strong 
babe strongs. Hi. Ooh, so you want to challenge Eric at the gym leader? I'll have you know we only let trainers with cute Pokemon enter the gym. Miles is adorable, you heartless. Thank you. No, you can't pet my Eevee. That's such an arbitrary, like, I don't know what their definition of cute is. Yeah. Like, I wonder if you could show her any Pokemon. She'd be like, oh, I love Caterpies. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, man, look at that Sizor. It's so cute. Yeah. I'm like, I... Sure. I love Grimers. Oh, okay. I like how they put little laurels over the heads of the, like, that is pretty statues cute. there. That is a really nice touch. It's interested in my chop down? Why? Oh, I uh, like your chop down. Ugh. But yeah, I think Vulpix would do well to have a little bit of experience in here. If it levels up, then it gets Roar, and then I can evolve it immediately mm -hmm. and not have to worry about shit anymore. Uh, everybody else is in the low 30s. If I'm about to fight Erica and I realize I'm, like, dramatically too low, then maybe I will go and do the game corner, but... Yeah, like, if you don't get more than a level yeah. <laughs> out of everything here or something somehow. Uh, Hypno is also good against, like, a bunch of the poison types, so... Yes, yeah, so I might switch that in as well. Depending on it, yeah. Um, I'm just gonna do a save, because I don't know when the last one was. I guess it was, like, at the end of the last episode, but whatever. All right, here we go. We are in, in the Celadon Gym. I'll show you my cute Pokemon. All right, that sounds cool. I'm down with that. Dun, 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 dun. Oh wait, but oh wait, no. So Vulpix is not is not Poison type yet. I might wait to what? evolve it. Or, or sorry, Vulpix is not Fairy type yet. Oh, I may wait until Erica to evolve it. Yeah. Just so I'm not putting it at needless risk because right now it's not going to be weak to it's not going to be weak to Poison. Look at that fluffy snow baby. Oh, oh, that's true. Uh, ice Beam. Yeah. Good news is Vulpix is pretty quick. Ooh, almost, okay. Toxic, what? That's a bummer. Alright. It's not going to do much in the way of damage right now, but still. <laughs> Ooh, four. Da -da -da -da. I was going to say just use Aura Beam. Eh. If I need to, I can go back out to the, to the Pokemon Center. Dun, dun, dun. You have to maximize your efficiency with your <laughs> PP. Ah, uh, my PP. Yeah, your PP efficiency. I've got the most efficient PP. <laughs> For all these strong babes. <laughs> They're just strong trainers. Yes. Any, any gender uh. could be in this gym. Well, no, they actually were very they were very particular about that only women are trainers in this gym. Like, Brock was not allowed to enter the Celadon gym. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying to... I'm just saying. What are you just saying, Ben? Anyone should be allowed in the gym. Wow. Wait, Brock wasn't allowed to enter? But like, yeah, they didn't... They, like, because he wasn't challenging the gym leader, they didn't want him hanging around. All right, so I think there's a ledge right here. I think this is just a shortcut. Yep. All right. I was going to say, what if Brock wanted to take the Pokemon League challenge? There's a trainer over there. Yep. This is going to go out here first. Okay. Just making sure with the... I was getting bored. Well, that's not my fault. So, yeah. there. What are you doing by yourself in the corner in a hedge maze? Right. Hedge mage. Execute. All right. Execute is interesting. I forgot about execute. Grass poison. Yeah. Uh, grass psychic. Grass psychic. Yep. Shit. Yeah doesn't really make a massive difference. I guess Confuse Ray would... Uh, I hit the wrong button. I was trying to hit Y, but that's fine. I mean, Confuse Ray is fine. It's helpful, I guess. What I was doing was double-checking because I keep forgetting between Confuse Ray and Confusion. Confusion is an attack. Yes. Confuse Ray is 100 accuracy. Yeah. And confuses. It's a very good... It is good. It is very good. good. It's a nice utility. It's a great way to open up a, a battle. Although, it seems like the... Ice Beam would have just one shot it anyway, but yep. uh, in general, it's pretty solid. All right. Give me a break. She has a little sweat thing under her eye. Is that what that was? Yes. Like an anime sweat. sweat. It's, uh, it's called a tear. Yeah. It's when uh, it's when you cry. Oh. Did you beat her so badly that she cried? No, I. Uh, she got sweaty and it got into her eye. Oh, and then she, and then yeah. she cried because of the salty sweat. Yes. That you got in her eye. Yes. 
Look at those puffy shorts. They're so weird. And easy Why? to wear. It looks like you're wearing a diaper. <laughs> she is. How old is this child? <laughs> oh, no. No, she has uh, She has that, that pooping syndrome. Oh, no. I know. It's really dark. Uh, Crohn's? Yes, that's the one. Uh, you know, Crohn's. pooping syndrome. <laughs> yeah. Crohn's is gnarly. That it's, is. It's more than just, like, There's so much that goes pooping. along with it, yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Was that Razor Leaf? It was Razor Leaf. Oh. It was just a lot more than I was anticipating there. Yeah. I mean, it's gloom, but still. Well, you don't resist it. It's true. That's true. And it's Stab, and not the greatest defenses. Yep, and it is an evolved Pokemon, yeah. so. Against an unevolved. Yeah. I don't want to see myself lose, so I'm going to close my eyes. Oh. That's so sad. Yep. Can we get a, Can we get an F in the chat for... I want every comment on this video oh, to no. be F. No. Every comment. Oh, Only no. Fs. Okay. Let us continue. You. Boy, me? Look, look. See my Pokemon. I like the grass type. I like how they're easy to raise <laughs> above my head because they're made out of plant <laughs> matter. They're easy to raise. I don't care much Beauty for doing Tamia. things. Is that a real thing? Like, do, most, do more plant Pokemon have the faster EXP track? I don't know if there's a real difference, to be honest. Because I know that Bulbasaur leveled a bit faster, or evolved faster at earlier levels. It does, yeah. Game. It evolves at the lowest levels of the of the three Kanto starters, for sure. Zoop. Oh. oh. All right. Oh, gross. Damn, purple glitter. Yeah. But now you're fabulous. Mm-hmm. Get another ice beam. Excuse me. I got it. All right. So just taking a look at John's levels. He has a level 34 Venusaur, a level 35 Pikachu that's a starter. Yeah. And a level 37 Charizard. Everybody else is... The other three are 29, 30, and 31. He does not have a Kadabra. He has a Dugtrio. Ooh. I remember because I was watching him, his, his stuff editing, and he caught an Abra. And I was like, son of a bitch is going to have a fucking Abra. Yeah. That's going to be a Kadabra in no time. Well, I might eventually switch to Abra Kadabra. Yeah. I'm going to switch for Hypno on this one just because I don't Mr. really. Mr. Bucket. Oh, uh, Mr. Bucket. Mr. Bucket. I'm going to mind freak you. Just because, like. Don't you get to switch when they announce that they're switching out? Yes, but now Vulpix gets some free extra experience. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Active, active experience. Yep. Poison jab. Ooh. He just sticks his tongue out and just like tongue pokes Yikes. my hypno. That did a lot. That did a lot. Alright. Yes, okay, good. I was like, please one hit, because that's making me a little <laughs> nervous. But yeah, so if I can have my team in the 34 35 zone, then I'm feeling pretty good about it. Hey, Miles is 34. Yep. No! I, <laughs> uh, but yes, actually. <laughs> yeah, I'm like uh, yes, though is the answer. The, the thing is, yes. Mm. So I'm gonna tell you this, but yeah. Uh, medicine pocket. Let's do a bunch of healing and shit. Boop, boop, boop. I I would have bought regular potions, but like, why? The super potions are not that expensive and way more useful in general. So I'm not gonna burn through 13 more here. I don't know, your hit points are still, like... What does Super Potion heal? Or, or Potion. 20. Uh, yep, yeah, okay. I hear you. You know? I'm back on board. Ah, Miles is so cute. Get the boy. Okay. Okay! That's what it sounds like. Oh, man. Oh, that's another okay, ledge. Well. I think I saw more lightning. In 10 seconds, we'll get the yeah. most intense rumbling in the tumbling. Oh. That was it, I think. <laughs> it was very, very s tiny. All right. What's your hobby? Yes, let's battle Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> like, wait, what? I'm sorry, what? What's your hobby? Yes, battling Pokemon? I. Uh, yeah? What? what? Oh, another gloom. Oh. Rick, I got a question for you. What's your question for me? I'm going to a popper tournament on uh, the 21st. Okay. Do I want? It's not a question. 
d could you give me a second? Okay. Do I want to didn't play? Ask question that second. Uh, do I want to play Tron or Four Color Snow? You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to be a bit more. Is Tron blue and white? Tron uh, refers to Urzatron, which is okay. uh, there's three different lands: Urza's mine, Urza's power plant, Urza's tower. Okay. Each of them tap for one colorless mana. Okay. Unless you have at least one of each mine, power plant, oh. tower on the field, and then your power plant and mines tap for two colorless mana, and tower taps for three colorless mana. Fuck. Wow. Okay. So they were all printed at common at some point. So okay. Popper so they were Tron all valid. Is a thing. Pretty solid. Um, what is four color snow? Four color snow. Uh, so a new card was just printed in Modern Horizons. Mm -hmm. It's an artifact that requires snow mana to play. What is snow mana? So it, it's, is that new or is that fake or is that what is that? It's been around for a while actually, but okay. it's just like. You know how there's islands and mountains and forests? Yes. There are also snow-covered islands, snow-covered forests, snow-covered oh, mountains. Oh, interesting. Okay. So it really doesn't make a big difference because in four-color snow, you're not running, like, Urza lands or anything. You're just running basic right. lands pretty so much. It's, so they act the exact same with the exception that there's that they are also snow. They are snow permanents. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, but this card, uh, Arkham's Astrolab, came out, and yeah. it costs snow mana to cast. When you play it, you draw a card, and yeah. you can pay one of any color mana, tap it, add one of any color mana to your mana pool. So it fixes your mana, which is why it basically lets you play four colors in Popper, where you normally need like better lands to do it. Okay, all right. Um, and it just it plays some cheap flyers that bounce a permanent back to your hand. Yeah. So you bounce the Astrolab back to your hand, play it again, draw a new card, oh my God. play another flyer, bring it back to hand, play it again, draw another card. Holy shit. And you kind of draw through, and you kind of dirtle around a bit drawing cards until you can find uh, Archeomancer, which lets you pull um, spells from your graveyard back to hand and start recurring some of your, like, uh, answers. Okay. So you got better counter spells and stuff. I That's like interesting. I yeah. like playing that deck more, but I think Tron is the better deck. I feel like Tron is... is I, feel, I feel like Tron is a more sturdy... Yeah. One, like once you get it set up, you're basically golden. Yeah, you have so much mana, you can do big things in Popper where normally things are pretty small. Yeah, I would say Tr I would say Tron between the two of those. Though four color snow sounds interesting as hell too. Yeah, uh, I I had a lot of fun trying it out and playing against. I was testing it with uh, Ooh, a couple of friends of mine. It was actually still pretty decent for a, for a move there. Didn't love that. I think Tron is kind of like the big bad deck of the format right now. All right. That didn't do much. I don't love Mega Drain right now. This is actually a problem. Oh shit! Yeah. Yeah. Um. It's is it toxic or poison? It's toxic, so it's gonna get worse each time, which is fine. I'm debate. I think I might put Eevee in and just do Sizzly Slide. You know? Mm. Yeah. Why not? Or Pikachu would resist Mega Drain. I don't think so. I thought does electric reduce? No, grass resist resist electric. No, oh, I'm sorry. Right. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's so cute. I still did a lot there too. Yeah, shit. At least, at least the toxic helps though. Like, if it was regular poison, then it'd be like whatever. But the toxic is gonna get worse each time. Yeah, by a bit. Yeah. Although now it's kind of like I mean, Sizzle is just gonna fucking. That's Rocket. a sturdy ass Tangela. Tangela's good. Well, I mean, not good, but well, like yeah. halfway decent. Yeah. And then uh, I like Tangrowth quite a bit. I don't like Tangrowth. I don't know. I think it's just because I like how Tangela looks. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's super goofy. Yeah. It's and it just like has man. shoes, like has feet. Like, oh, God. <laughs> I didn't even think about that part. <laughs> like, what is, what I like is Tangela's socks a lot better. <laughs> Or it has two tongues coming out of it, <laughs> the bottom no. of it. Like, two biological know. sock tongues. Yeah, I don't really know what that is. Yeah, Latifa. Nice. God, you really need right. a... Yeah, I'm going to go back and heal. Moonstone. And I need a Moonstone. You should go back and get a Moonstone. Oh, man. Take a couple episodes. Oh, Jesus. Just go get a Moonstone. Yeah, apparently I, I missed one in Mount Moon, and someone said that there's one that is accessible right now, too. 
Oh. Like, not maybe not now, meaning, like, in Celadon City, but, like... But a bit more close by than Mount Moon? Yeah. Uh, but I think, I, I think I'm gonna not look for advice on that. I think I'm gonna play things that... Play it as it lies. Uh, I guess. Uh, this is gonna be a long episode, too, actually. I, like, part of me is like, oh, I should break it off now, but if the rest the of next this is short... Be nothing, yeah. I got at least a couple battles, though. Let's br let's br uh, let's break it off. All right, let's we'll see you next time. Here.